presidential candidate Andrew Yang has proposed a universal basic income plan. His plan is a grand a month for everyone over 18. Every American adult at the age of 18 should get $1,000 a month free and clear from the government to do whatever they want. Rich, poor, middle class, don't matter. Free money for all. Who wants it? Free for everybody. It's not just liberals who support it. Believe it or not, some libertarians support it too. Kind of weird for people who are supposed to be against the welfare state, right? Well, their argument is the libertarian ideal isn't politically feasible, so UBI is better than the current system. We need to evolve. We need to actually start pushing the way we think of economic progress to include how our families are doing, how our children are doing, uh, and things that would actually matter to the American people. Let's be realistic. If we accept that government welfare is a given, shouldn't we at least try to restrict it to the needy instead of expanding it to include everybody? And that's why universal basic income is so crucial because it gets the boot off of people's throats and it replaces the mindset of scarcity with a mindset of abundance and rationality and optimism and capacity. Libertarian supporters argue it would be less bureaucratic and save money. I argue they are living in la-la land. I just heard you play and I wonder. If they think UBI will ever replace the welfare state, it's progressive supporters who far outnumber libertarians have zero interest in reducing the government. Take your places, please. Right. Let's see which one of us can touch his toes. Right over from the hips, brothers and sisters, please. One, two, one, two. <coughs> They believe UBI is a basic human right. Most likely, it will be added onto our welfare state, costing way more money than the status quo. Maybe even as high as $3.8 trillion a year. That's a lot of money. It's a lot of money. And what about the bad incentives it would create? The libertarians often say that prolonged welfare give people a disincentive to work. Another pointless day where I accomplish nothing. Now, imagine if literally every single adult was on the government dole for life. Sure, $12,000 a year is very hard to live on in most places, but it would encourage people to not work, Today I don't feel work less, or take longer to look for a job. Yeah, well, you know, that's just like uh, your opinion, man. So no, UBI would not be better than the status quo. Expanding and adding on to our welfare state is not something libertarians should support. Hey, did you like this video? Subscribe to our friends at The Daily Caller. And if you're like me, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Julie Borowski, and check out my merch site, libertyjunkies.com. Thank you and have a great day.